for the second straight game. Northwestern tries to win their sixth and seven tries. And Barnheiser with the opening miss, but gets it back. It's Bowie putting down a three. Top 15 in efficiency. And led by Perkins, Sanford, and Freeman. Here's Sanford with the first shot. And that goes down. For Peyton Sanford and shoot around. You just you have to stay connected. You cannot lose it. Now Blake Smith knocks that down. The walk-on on the board. They've won. And, and that's what this team has been, and that's why they've been so good. Well, Martinelli coming off a career high. The miss is ricocheted to Bowie. And Smith off the shot fake into the body of Freeman. Claiming some confidence. Well, Iowa coming off a nine-point win against Penn State where Peyton Sanford had a triple-double, the first in Iowa men's basketball history. And he has another three up and six points on the board right away for Sanford. And here comes Iowa, foot on the gas. It's going to be fascinating to watch this transition defense for the Cats. Man, Sanford falling away with eight already. Well, Peyton was, had, was able to get his wide-open shot. Well, Freeman blocks Bowie, who sticks with it and turns it over. Well, Perkins trying to turn the turnover into transition points, and he does with Freeman. A shorthanded Northwestern offense. They need every point they can get on offense, and Perkins takes the hit and scores. Oh, man's land there, right? Like, you have a lot in front of you. You get that double bye, now all of a sudden you set yourself up for a great run in the Big Ten tournament. Back-to-back -to -back hits for Boo Booing. A little over 50 guys at Iowa have gone over 53 guys. There's Nicholson with a slam. A larger stretch of a 16 4 spurt for the Cats. Oh, no look for the damn jam. Blake Preston off the give from Bowie. Now, then Northwestern made them become individuals, and that's where they've struggled recently. Well, that's a couple of times now. Iowa has influenced Bowie to make a decision midair. And Dix cashes in. With Sanford and Dix both hitting them to force a timeout. Well, it all comes in transition. If you're Northwestern, you have to find shooters in transition. Well, Martinelli has so many tools. You know, one of the two guys starting because of injury. Martinelli and Smith because of Langbord and Barry out. There's Freeman. He had been quiet. There's Perkins on Bowie. And Smith checking Sanford. It's a Dix three. And he drains it again. Uh, Payton does a good job of breaking. And then read the angles that he creates. Career high 27 for Martinelli last game. He's up to eight today. And lefty for lefty again. It's Ben Cricky. Bowie on Dix using the Preston screen. Zigzagging, falling, tapped around. Sanford rebound. Here comes Perkins downhill. Sanford, transition three. That much tighter. On this end, don't give up easy buckets. Make Iowa work for it. That's a tough shot. A but Dix defense, makes I, but that's what a Dix lot of those. I get it, but... 14-1 overall, 8-0 in the Big Ten. Oh, man, another great draw up from Fran McCaffrey. They are so good at their end line out of bounds. Best in the country. Nobody better. Nobody. Another three for Bowie. Big bowling guy you are, huh? You too? Yeah, occasionally. Barnheiser the answer. The lead, two trips for Iowa. And a turnover. Out of the pack, Smith slams it down for the Cats. Where does Iowa go? Leading the clock in the hands of Sanford. Turned the corner, fouled, and scored! They hung tight, but getting dire late, down seven. And Martinelli scores quickly. Bowie roaming to the rim, gives up Smith, got to get a shot up here. They don't! Iowa steals it! Clock running out! Tricky finishes it for the Hawkeyes! A bubble-moving win for the Iowa Hawkeyes. A quad one win on the road at Northwestern.